We will hear, I have no doubt, a lot from the Minister whose sincerity and commitment in this area is beyond question. But however welcome the good intentions are, however much we applaud the ambitions, what is a matter of grave concern is the lack of capacity and resource that's in the system. Our very own all-party all parliamentary group for music uh, education in its uh, State of the Nation report concluded, and I quote, the overall picture is one of serious decline. If the pace continues, music education in England will be restricted to a privileged few within a decade, and the UK will have lost a major part of the talent pipeline to its world-renowned music industry. And my Lords, the facts uh, speak uh, for themselves. Uh, this year's exam results, uh, indeed, as the Independent Society of Musicians states uh, in, uh, in no uncertain terms, states that they are a, a, a wake-up call, and they are a wake-up call, they tell their own story. A 36% drop in, in GCSEs, a 45% drop in A-level music entries in England, Wales and in Northern Ireland since 2010. A crisis in teacher training and recruitment, with schools increasingly forced uh, to cut music provision or use non-specialists to teach music as a result. Uh, so, my Lords, we have a, a crisis. A crisis that needs to be addressed, yes, by funding, but also a crisis, I would uh, suggest, that needs to be addressed by looking at the way in which, within our education system, we actually value, uh, value music. And the fact of the matter is that the English uh, baccalaureate uh, doesn't uh, value the subject.